Hey guys, so today we are going to be checking the results of our DNA test. Hi, I'm Yunji, Lee Yunji. I'm from Korea, South Korea. Um, I think I'm 100% Korean because I cannot live my life without kimchi or rice or just anything Korean. But I know not everyone's 100%. I think I could be like 97% Korean and maybe like 2% Mongolian because my family, we are slightly taller than average Koreans and I've met lots of Mongolians and we look alike. So, and maybe 1% Chinese or Japanese because, you know, Chinese, Korean, Japanese, we are all close to each other. I mean, yeah. So I know my whole family has lived in the Philippines. My grandparents, my parents, their parents have lived in the Philippines. So as far as I know, my whole lineage has been Filipino, but uh, I don't know. So obviously the Philippines was conquered by a lot of countries like Spain, Japan, and you know, just lots of other countries over the years. So my guess is 95% Filipino, 3% Spanish, and 2% Indonesian. Actually, before I did my test, I put a, a poll on my Instagram and asked a bunch of people what they thought I was. This is the results of that poll. Okay, are you ready for this? Okay. I think, I think you're gonna like your results. I think you're gonna like your results. Okay, Yunji. You are not the father. <laughs> the DNA Bally. results are in, and you are not the father. <laughs> Bally, Bally. Okay, Yunji, you are 94% Korean. Crazy, right? Okay, we, we, we expected 94%. Okay, what, what's That's, the other 6%? Okay, no way. Yunji, you are 6% Japanese. Wait, really? You have like, you have nothing else. You, you are just Korean and Japanese. Oh. Oh, it's really interesting. I'm 6% Japanese. 6% <laughs> Yuji, 6% Japanese. Do I get to claim to be Japanese? I 6%. I mean, that's a that's a pretty big percentage now. Oh. <laughs> yeah, or that's why I love sushi. I mean, sashimi, ramen. I wonder when this happened. Baekje or... Joseon or Daehanjeguk? I don't know. I mean, Korea and Japan have been, you know, neighbors. traveling yeah. neighbors for thousands since the of years. Of time, so it could have happened any time during that time period. <laughs> You're 81% Southern Filipinos. 81%? Mm-hmm. Okay. Is there a Northern Filipino? 14% Northern Filipinos. Okay. So 81 plus 14, so 95. <laughs> so I am 95% Filipino. 1% Southern China. 1% Southern Chinese. Made in China. 1%. 1% Wales. Really? Mm-hmm. Interesting. I know. Okay, and 3%? I don't know how to read it. Oh, Basque. Wow, 3%. I was right. So I was, I was pretty much spot on. So when I started this channel, I actually made a video that was called Are Filipinos Asian, Hispanic, or Pacific Islander? And one of the things I said was like, yeah, Filipinos are Hispanic by definition because you know, to be Hispanic, you just need to have a cultural connection to Spain. But a lot of people were complaining in the comments saying that, no, Filipinos don't have any Spanish blood. They never really intermixed. So, huh, 3% Spanish. <laughs> what do you think about that? <laughs> and 1% Southern China, including Taiwan. No. Well, I mean, that, that makes sense because uh, according to like migration patterns, before people migrated to the Philippines, they actually came 
from like the southern tip of Taiwan and then they migrate to the Philippines. So yeah, it actually makes a lot of sense. Now we know why you like boba so much. <laughs> <laughs> now we know why I like boba, that 1% that Chinese. Whales, 1%? 1% whales, that, that is the most surprising for me. I mean, I, I guess that must, have, that must have also come from the Spanish part of me. Uh, you know, whatever, whichever one of my ancestors were Spanish, uh, they must have had also a little bit of whales in them. I'm really curious if you're Korean or I mean any other Asians and you find out you're not just one, you know? I mean, I bet there are a lot of us, but please share in the comments so I know. <laughs> Alright guys, that is it for our video. Remember to subscribe to Pactown Blondes, uh, that's Yoonji's channel, and thanks for watching. I just took a DNA test, turns out I'm 100% that bitch.